You are listening to the Life Coach Business Podcast with Amanda Carlstad, episode number 122. Welcome to the Life Coach Business Podcast, a show for coaches who are ready to up-level their business and take their impact, leadership, and results to a whole new level. If you're ready to start taking powerful action and become the leader your business needs in order to grow and thrive, this show is for you. I'm your host, Amanda Carlstad, certified life and business coach and entrepreneurial leadership expert. Now let's get down to business. Hello and welcome everyone. Welcome to today's show. I hope you're doing well. I hope you are healthy and well wherever you are. I'm so glad to have you here. I have to tell you, I am really fired up for today's show. Not only have I been thinking of all of you and I'm extremely fired up for what we're about to talk about, but I have been thinking a lot about today's topic and I think that it's really going to help so many of you. And I'm also really excited because I have a really special invitation for all of you. So one of my goals for this year is to help as many established coaches as possible So these are coaches who are looking to scale. And typically what that means is that they've already hit or are close to that six-figure mark in their business, and they're looking to scale. So they're looking to go to 250K, they're looking to go to 500K, they're looking to go to a million dollars and beyond in their business. And this year, one of my personal goals is the level of impact that I'm making and really helping as many coaches as I can really take their businesses to the next level. So with that, I have a personal impact goal of helping a certain number of established coaches do that through my high-level mastermind. So if your goal is to build a million dollar a year plus business, then I have a very special invitation for you. I want to invite you to join us to build your million dollar business this year. This is exactly what we're doing. We are building million dollar plus businesses and I want to invite you to join us if you're at that six figure or close to that six figure level in your business. So if you're serious about taking your business to that next level and you know that you need a higher level of support, if you know that you need expert coaching and mentorship, then I want to invite you to apply as there are limited spots available. Enrollment is currently open for my high-level mastermind for established coaches who want to build million-dollar businesses. And because I'm interested in getting my clients results, that is my number one goal. And my clients are the most driven, the most ambitious. They are the best. They are the most professional coaches who want to build their businesses in a way that allows them to have a high level of freedom, a high level of flexibility, make a huge impact, and also make a ton of money. And quite frankly, they're at a place where they don't want to waste any more time. So if this sounds like you, then I want to invite you to apply for my high-level mastermind. As I mentioned, I'm currently opening up enrollment for a select number of established coaches who are looking to go to a million dollars and beyond, and they want to do it in the most streamlined and accelerated way, then I want to invite you to come and join us. That is what we are doing. So you can go ahead and apply to be part of this group. This is a room of high-level coaches who are either in the process right now of scaling their business to a million or who will be on track for that in the very near future. So if you're interested, go to amandacarlsteadcoaching.com. We're going to also link that up, that application in the show notes. I highly recommend if your goal is to build a million dollar business that you take action and you get in this room, you get in this container. There's a very high level of customized coaching and support that is offered. And because of this, there are limited seats available. And so because my goal is to help as many of you as possible this year, hit your business goals, and I'm ready to coach you. I'm ready to mentor you and guide you in this process. I want to invite you to be a part of this very special group where my goal is to help you truly become an example of what is possible. And in fact, this is the goal that I have for every client that I work with is to help them truly become examples of what is possible. So if you're serious, if this sounds like you, if you're an established coach and you are ready to go to the next level, then I want to invite you to join us. 
to build your million dollar business this year. Go to amandacarlstadcoaching.com. We're going to link up that application in the show notes. I highly recommend you do this sooner rather than later and come on in, be a part of this group. My clients, they are killing it and we'd love for you to join us. All right. Let's talk about seven figure action today, my friends. So as I mentioned, I am really fired up for today's conversation. And the reason I feel so fired up is because it's something that recently, especially I've been seeing, is holding so many of you back. It's holding so many of you back from achieving the goals, the level of success that quite honestly, you're capable of achieving in your business. And as I was thinking about this, I realized that I haven't done an entire episode about this recently. And so I decided after having some conversations with clients and just some general observations that I've had recently that I really needed to bring this topic to you today. So I want to talk to you all about taking seven figure action. And what I mean by that is taking seven figure action in your business taking a level of action that is at a quality level that actually creates a seven-figure business, okay? So this is seven-figure action that actually moves the needle, that actually aligns with what it takes to create a seven-figure business. So the reason I think this is so important to you and One of the things that I want to say here is that I think there is a lot of confusion in this industry about where to put your focus. I think if you're building an online business, I think this is true for the coaching industry, but I also think this is true in a lot of online businesses is that there is a lot of confusion right now about where to put your focus, where to put your time, where to put your energy, how to build your business. And I want to be real with you all right now. While yes, there are always going to be different approaches, there are always going to be different ways of going about and building your business, there's always going to be the latest and greatest social media tactic. The truth is, is that it doesn't matter what type of business you're building. So this could be a coaching business, this could be a product-based business, this could be a huge corporation. The truth is, is that there are certain foundational things in the business that must be in play, that must be built. There are certain principles that it doesn't matter again, what type of business you're building that have to be followed. And so what we're talking about here today is the things that are going to be required if you want to build a million dollar plus level of business. And in order to properly build these foundational elements, it also requires a level of action that's congruent with producing those types of results. And one of the things that I love about the coaching industry in particular is that for my clients and for those of you who are listening to this podcast, for those of you who are in my world, I know that you have a deep level of belief in your business. I know that you know you're here to do really big work in the world. And for most of you, I know that many of you, in fact, have already done some really big work in your life, that your work is important to you. You're very accomplished already. And I also know that the work you do with your clients, that it really truly matters, that you're extremely capable, that you are a high achiever, that you've done amazing things already, whether that was in your career prior to coaching, or maybe you're in your career right now, or just in general. And I love that. But I have to tell you, there's a real difference that I see for my most successful clients, for the clients who are examples of what is possible. So these are all clients that had the belief, that had a deep level and have a deep level of belief in their work and in themselves. But they also, I have to tell you all, they also followed that belief and proved that belief with taking some serious action in their businesses. They took action and take action today in their businesses on a level that is congruent with the level of results that they want to achieve. So I wanna give you an example of this. Recently, I was having a conversation with one of my high-level clients who were right now in the process of scaling her business to a million this year. 
And we're talking about how over this past year, in looking at her growth and how far she's come, how amazing it's been because she's had this goal, this goal of making 50K plus a month in her business. And when she first decided that this was her goal, when she first decided that this was what she really wanted to go after, she had a belief that she could do it. She knew that it was possible for her. She could see the potential. But at the same time, she also had doubts. She also had thoughts that were on the contrary to that. She had a lot of things through the process of getting her business to that place. I will just tell you that surfaced because she was in a place of massive personal transformation in the past year, because she went through a major identity shift of moving into a level of business owner that creates $50,000 plus on a monthly basis, there were many times at that belief that it wasn't all there. And as her coach, and as I'm sharing all of this with you today, what I want to really point out here is the difference that actually took her to that 50K and beyond mark monthly in her business, what actually helped her to get there and to stay there and to now have created that on a consistent basis so that now that is her new normal is the level of action that she took along the way, is the level of action that she was willing to do in that process while she was building that belief in herself, while she was building the belief in her goals. And I have to tell you all, again, as her coach, there were a lot of moments that she had that that belief, it was not all there, that it was shaken up a bit. There was evidence that her brain was offering to her, especially in the beginning, especially when the evidence wasn't there, that could have very easily stopped her from moving forward at the level that she did. That would have definitely offered her a place to settle, that had she not had the clarity and the strategy and really the roadmap to take the action forward, had she not known what actions to take, she would have been stuck. She would have kept wondering, what do I need to do? What am I missing? But because she had the courage to first believe and to first set that goal and then follow that up with the courage to take a level of action that actually gave her the opportunity to create those results, she was able to build her capability around so many things that Honestly, a year ago, she had no idea how to do. She is now, her business is in a completely different place. She's in a completely different place than she was a year ago. And now she has an opportunity. She's in an exciting place where she's literally scaling to a million dollars and beyond right now. So this is why this topic is so important. This is why taking seven-figure action is so powerful. And by the way, seven-figure action has to be taken before you actually bring in the million dollars. It is what will actually create the million dollars and beyond. So I want to be very clear here that while you might be believing you can build a million-dollar business, I want you to know I believe that for you too. I think it's available to each and every one of you listening to this podcast right now you are probably thinking about your million dollar business. And that's amazing and great. And that's where it starts. But I also want you to understand that that is step one. That true belief is then demonstrated with real, tangible, and what I'm calling seven-figure action. It's demonstrated by real, tangible action that produces results. So unless you start taking a level of action in your business that builds a million dollar business, until you take a level of action in your business that literally will equate to the things that actually support a million dollar business growth, unless you start taking that quality action in your business that actually supports the level of growth that you want, 
you're going to spin. You're going to spend so much time in self-doubt. You're going to spend your time second guessing everything you're doing. Or, and I see this happen, you might be spending your time holding yourself back when the truth is, and the, the honest truth is, is that you could be making so much more revenue right now in your business. So this is why I'm so passionate about this. This is why I wanted to bring this topic to you all today. It's because it's essential. If you want to take your business to a million dollars and beyond, it's why you must start taking million dollar action in your business. And I'm not talking about spending millions of dollars to make millions of dollars. That's not what I'm saying. In fact, I believe and the way that I coach my clients and I teach my clients is that it's really important that we build their businesses in a way that's sustainable. I'm talking about taking strategic planned action that builds the foundation for you to scale your business to a million and beyond. And I have to be honest, there's a few reasons that I see that are very common in holding a lot of you back. And it's also why for my clients, when they come into my container, when they come into the room where the standard is, this is what we're doing, we are building million dollar businesses here. It's why I believe that they make such huge progress in such a short amount of time. It's why we literally have clients who come in and are doubling their businesses, many within the first couple of months. Some do it within a matter of weeks. It's how we have clients that literally go from working with clients on a one-on-one basis to scaling to a million dollars in less than two years. It's how we have clients who come in and launch group programs and implement things that are needed in their business that literally take them to multiple six figures in a matter of a few short weeks and months. And it's why my belief and my philosophy and what I teach is that we only focus on the things based on their business, based on who they serve, based on their goals that are really going to move the needle. It's why we only take action that supports seven-figure growth. It's why for every one of my clients, it's why they're able to transform and become the leaders their business needs them to be. And it's because of them having the courage to take this level of action in their business that is driven from a level of belief that it's already done, that the multiple six, that the seven figure business, whatever that number is, that it's already done. Because here's the truth. When you've fully committed to grow a million dollar business, not only do you need to make that decision and commit to that decision internally, not only do you need to commit to that decision on a cognitive level, but you have to follow up that cognitive commitment with real seven-figure action. And that means building your business and having a real business strategy. That means building your business with real intention. That means building your business, ensuring that all the things that are required to build a million-dollar business, that means that you're doing those things and you're doing them in the order that makes sense. And I see a lot of coaches who are focusing efforts. They're focusing their precious time and their precious energy, their precious resources on tactics and things that will never add up to a seven-figure business. So many are held back, even from current containers that they're in, that are telling them that it's not possible, that are literally holding them back because they think they have to do things a certain way, or they think they have to build their business in a certain way. And so this is why taking seven-figure action in your business is so important. It's why putting yourself in an environment that supports you in taking seven-figure action, even though, yes, it's going to feel uncomfortable. Yes, it's going to stretch you. Yes, it's going to require more of you. It's also the best part, and it will be the hardest. And it will be the most valuable type of action you can be taking. And so this isn't about posting seven times a day on social media. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about the real work of building a seven-figure foundation, of expanding your vision of what is possible for you, and then building the framework, the business ecosystem, the structure that truly supports a million-dollar-plus business. And that, my friends, is really rare because there's a lot of hype. There's a lot of shiny objects. There's a lot of time and energy being spent on non 
seven figure actions. There's a lot of time digging into and entertaining thoughts and belief systems about why a seven figure business is not possible for you. There are even a lot of containers that in my opinion, they mean well, but they're actually enabling a level of thinking and enabling a lot of non seven figure action. And so what I want to invite you all to here in this episode is I want to invite you to open up to the possibility. I want to open you up to expanding into your highest potential. You know, you already can. Your brain might be telling you that you can't. And I want to tell you that's okay. Part of taking seven figure action is being able to manage your brain and manage your emotions and getting yourself to a place where you can show up and take this level of action in your business. In fact, I believe a real decision, a real commitment to a seven-figure business, that decision becomes real when you are following that up with a level of action that is on that same level. So until you put yourself on the playing field, my friends, until you put yourself in an environment where you're playing to win, action is evidence of your belief. And I want to say that again, action is evidence of your belief. So if you're in a place right now where you're saying, I'm doing all the things and you feel like you're, you've got a lot of doubt or a lot of fear, and you're questioning whether or not you're capable of building a seven figure business, then I want to offer to you to go take some seven figure action, go take some action that is on the level of what an actual seven figure business owner would do get into an environment that is going to support you in doing that. And that might mean, yes, I'm going to pitch it. You might need to get yourself into my program, either my high level program or my mastermind program, depending on where you're at with your revenue. That's going to give you not only the how on how to actually build the business on the actual right actions to be taking, but also how to help you step into and embody your highest level that's going to coach you at the highest level on your inner game, that is going to activate your highest potential, the highest version of you, so that you can show up and take that seven-figure action that lays out the process for you to do that, so that you can finally stop holding yourself back, so you can finally stop wasting time and start taking the level of action that's congruent with the level of results that you want, that you already believe you can create. So I want you all to go out and take some seven figure action today, my friends. Have an amazing week. I will talk to you all again very soon. Take care. Bye-bye. Thank you for listening to this episode of the Life Coach Business Podcast. If you want to learn more about how to build, grow, and scale your business and accelerate your results, visit amandacarlstadcoaching.com.